All right, so welcome back to a comedy of terrors. I I said I was gonna do Dead by Daylight, but then I realized it would be such a pain to get the PS4 hooked up. No, I'm just lazy. I just didn't want to unplug the microphone from the computer here and plug it into the PS4 here because I'm lazy. But uh, then I realized not technically a horror game but definitely homage and also a game that has very much to do with the whole reason i'm doing this entire series the mystery of castle super beast starring one half of the shitstorm and one fourth of the best friends channel pat woolly and then i realized of course i'm gonna fucking i, I can't not but uh what the fuck were the controls? Okay. For pure Eurojank, we got ZXC, RNF, our mystery button, jump, and move. Now I have. I don't believe I'm gonna be beating this. I'm bad at these games. But, uh, movement, tank controls, even more tank controls. Rigid like a tank, classic horror, aka tank controls. Oh, wait. Oh, no matter what button you hit. <laughs> Even more. Rigid like a tank. Classic core. Panzer enthusiast. Strid. Strid's vag control. I assume that's another language for tank control. Pat mode. Alone in the night. I'm gonna put it to pat mode. Subtitles on. Still on, yes, absolutely. This should always be on. Pretend they aren't here. English, not French. On, with extra tank controls. I'll take that last one. Now, you see, th these aren't real options, but they are joke references to the fact that, uh... Every time the best friends would play a game where the tank... where, uh, the subtitles were off, they would always question, Why? Why would you start it off? Because I've always, I agree with that. I've always felt like, uh, like, subtitles for a show, I feel like you don't need them. Unless it's anime, because then, and unless you're fluent in Japanese, because then you don't know what they're saying. But in a video game, it's like, why would you need this? It's like, well, in a video game, a lot of, in a TV show, a lot of, not, a lot of everything is scripted. Nothing's gonna be unusual. But in a game, there's gonna be a lot of extra sound effects that the game developers planned for, but can't fully predict. Because I, I can tell you, I've played a game or two where uh, I did something and then like people started talking, and if there were no subtitles, I wouldn't understand them because it's like, oh no, I just triggered like a massive explosion, you're just expositing to me. Good thing I can read it. Let's read it. This is Remarai. Go check out his YouTube channel. It's really, really good. He makes animations of uh, these two idiots. I love every single one. They're beautiful. They're, it's like an art. Shut up, Silent Hill. I'm already doing it. This is a non-profit fan game. Should have, should have made me pay you money, Remarai. I would have given it to you. Uh, in a French game he played when he was very young. I don't know what game it is. But, uh, he, he's, our, he's shilling what I shill. Go to check out Cast Super Beast and also Wooly Wolves and Angriest Pat on Twitter. You probably ha- hold on, am I following Remarai on Twitter? Hold on, this is more important than whatever the fuck I'm doing. Uh, there's my Twitter. Rem -er. Rai. The hell I'm not? There we go. I fixed it. I've I have followed him. Uh. Oh man, the fucking powdered milk. Oh shit, that was a good one. That was a very good animation he did the powdered the one where they they discussed the logistics of milk to cereal ratio how evil are you 
I think I think my favorite one he did was um, I've got distracted and stopped pressing buttons, so you're probably just bored staring at the screen listening to me exposit out my face. The fuck was that? Oh, it's water. <laughs> I did not see that till now. Is the um? I think it. What? Which one was it? Um, it was the. Uh, let me get the name right. Before we begin, the person who made this game would like to make an announcement. By all means, go for it. There will be scares, but there will be only one jump scare in this game. It could really happen whenever, even when you least expect it, boo. That wasn't it, but you get the idea. It could happen at any moment. Thank you for your time. Let's start the game. Now I know when the jump scare is, because I watched both Wooly and Pat play and beat this game. And I'm not telling you when it is. You want it? You go play the game yourself. Hey. Hey, you. You in the cell. Wake up. Hey, boy. Uh, hang on. Rim. What's going on? Where am I? Oh, I forgot. I forgot. He made the voice sounds by just taking audio clips of them and like banjo kazooieing it. Oh, that's great. Remarai. Uh, let's see. Gazebo. Fight gazebo. No. Got cereal milk. No. Big secret. Every teacher gets one. That's good. Space capitalism. Oh, I forgot. Oh, I love space capitalism. Uh, ah. Castle Super Beast Animated Food Tampering. Go watch that one. That is, like, my favorite one. Oh, God. Oh, God. It's fucking tank controls. Z. Use the arrow keys to move around, and you can interact with them using the Z key. I'm guessing you figured that out already because otherwise I don't have a clue what's going on here. But did you know that you can hurry up by holding the X key? Yeah, I... That, I believe, is a reference, like, a joke about how... Oh, I didn't even notice. He just lifts his shoulder. That's really cool. Um, it's... That's a joke about how, like, lots of games... Like, you'll walk up to the first tutorial paper or whatever, and it'll be like... To move around, use this, and to interact with things, press this key, and it's like, yeah, game. No shit, how do you think I got to this point? I had to walk here and interact with this object to read you telling me how to do exactly that. I'm not a comatose rock. Alright. It's very, it's very modern tank controls, because... Notice, notice how I just spun in a fucking circle. Can't do that with old-fashioned tank controls. You want to play the original Resident Evil? You have two directions. You can go forward or back. And if you want to go left or right, you gotta stop, turn, move. None of this namby-pamby curves. Oh, hey, Pat. Wooly, is that you? Holy shit, get over here. Hey, Pat. Pat, what's going on? How should I know? I just woke up in here. The door's locked. I did find a key, but it doesn't fit this lock. Get me out. I was about to say, like, it's a shame they didn't play it together, and then we'd have audio of them both reading their own lines. But then I realized they did stream it. So in theory, someone could just rip the audio of them reading the lines and we could have a totally voiced version of the game. Has someone done that? Has someone just overlaid the voices on footage? I'd be down for either. I think that'd be really fun. How should I know? I just woke up in here. The door's locked. I did find a key, but it doesn't fit this lock. Get me out. All right, I'll have a look around. We might be able to force it open with something. Don't go anywhere. Fucking hilarious, Wooly. Uh, uh, this 
I love this game when it's it's really well made. I believe Remurai made it himself. And it's really good. But what most is just like the humor in it. It's, uh, I didn't even read this. I was too busy just being enamored with the game. You can also use Zeke, you talk to people. Sometimes you can even use items on them through the menu. I'm starting to get hiccups. I don't know why. You do that by pressing enter, selecting what you want to press. Want you want press oh oh hey a menu yeah will I have to attache case this game I do not know yeah yeah do a little run you gonna feel a slight draft of fresh air coming from beyond this door. Okay. Better run back down. Oh wait, Pat has a key. Yeah, 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 Pat, yeah, could you maybe yeah, yeah, hand me that key? I might be able to use it. No, for all I know you'll use this key to escape and leave me here forever. Come on. Don't you trust me, Willie? Here's a life tip. Take it from me. Don't trust anyone. Oh, okay, it's just, yeah, no, it's just, it's just some dialogue. Well, gotta, gotta find another means. There's, there's another Z prompter down here, so that's, that's good news. I forgot about the jump. Look at, look at this magical jump. You ready? The fucking sound effect is beautiful. Let me guess. Press the spacebar to jump. Thank you. Alright, what's down here? The fuck is this? You have picked up a bottle. The liquid inside smells sweet, inviting, and its scent fills you with vigor. Cool. You also use Z to pick up items. So use those, enter Z. Okay, yeah, it's just introducing menu usage. Let's down this hallway. A dead end. Oh! And a trusty crowbar. To equip some items, select them in the menu by pressing enter. You can strike things. All right. Yeah! Yeah, take that! Oh, he's shrinking! Oh, you nerd, you shrunk! I am the victor, for I am still large. Everyone knows when you get tiny, that means you lose. What is this? A pouch containing some bullets. Ah, oh, sick. I found the pouch full of golf balls for the golf ball gun. I don't believe there's a golf ball gun, but they sure looked like golf balls, didn't they? Like the the many polygonal sides made me think of uh, little dimples on a golf ball. Wait, is it? That's not the one I came out of, is it? Oh, it's not. Oh, a book. A journal of some kind. Most of the injuries are pretty mundane, but the last page six steps. The king promised us so much, but his vision for the future has led to disaster. Ooh. If we can't get out of here soon, I don't think there's any hope left for us. My time is running out. 
At this point, all I can do is hope this nightmare never happens again. That's right, I'm vaguely remembering now. It's been a while since I watched the streams of it. Something about there's like a king and he did something and like cursed the land. Oh, I remember what's about to happen. Hey, Pat. Great, hand it over. I think I can get better leverage from in here. Here you go, man. We need to escape as soon as possible. I don't want to spend another minute in here. God fucking... 20 minutes later. What's this made of? Break? What kind of sadistic asshole designed? I was just at home minding my own business. This is unbelievable. All doors should... Well, at least you got that out of your system. Yeah, I guess. Here, take this key. You go ahead, and if you survive long enough, I'm right behind you. Uh, wait. So you might be wondering what, what the fuck happened. Oh, Pat, Pat just, in a fit of Pat rage, punched down the door. Well, what are you waiting for? Let's go. Oh, man. It's just, it's just so real. Hey! Time to crate. We finally found one. You know what the best part about playing this is? I can make all the fucking best friends references I want. And it's not gonna, it's only gonna be slightly obnoxious. That was the jump button. Can I, can I move this? No. I can't attach a case my, uh, inventory. Attach a case for those who aren't watching the best friends, like it's a goddamn religion. Is in reference to the like solid four minutes of footage you can get of uh, during Matt and Pat playing Resident Evil 4, Pat just organizing the inventory of Leon Kennedy, and it's it's just, it's called Attaché Case HD because it's 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 like a highlight of the Let's Play. Wow, what a mansion! Sorry, I couldn't resist. Resident Evil 1. There's some people, at least they don't seem like the kidnapping type. Is this the part where we split up and look for clues? Not quite, Wooly. Now you see, when I saw this, I'm like, oh shit, was Pat behind it? And the answer was, no, this is the part where you go look for clues, and I stay right here in the corner until help arrives. And then I realized, oh no, this is Pat. He's just... <laughs> this... If you were in an actual situation like this with Pat, this is actually what Pat would do. Because it's Pat. What, what do you think? <laughs> You're a real team player, Pat. If a stranger comes too close, I'm liable to bite them. That's the correct uh, reaction. But no, like, I, I, may say, I may reference them a lot and geek out over them. But seriously, if it wasn't for the best friends, like, a lot of the games I'm into, I just wouldn't know about or play. Or even care about. Like, Resident Evil. I would still be like, it's just a dumb horror game. Or Yakuza. I wouldn't even know what the fuck Yakuza is. And now it's like one of my favorite series. And not just because like, oh, the best ones liked it, so I gotta like it. No. Like, because Yakuza's really good, and I really like it. It's fun, it's wacky. Oh, it's so much fun. Plus, the gameplay is really fun. Like, there's a lot of games they like that I don't enjoy. Like, or I don't actively play a lot. Like, they all love Devil May Cry. I am terrible at it. It's a fun game. I don't have five because I know I wouldn't beat it or really get too far. I want to. I want to get better. I'm just terrible at understanding how combos work. Hello, I'm Benjamin, but everyone usually calls me Ben. How are you? Hi, Ben. I'm Wooly. Nice to meet you. Haha, <laughs> but what's your actual name, though? That is my actual name. 
Oh, you're serious. I'm awfully sorry, Willie. This got horribly awkward. Seems like this whole night's not great for anyone. I'm guessing you don't recall how we got here. What's the last thing you do remember? I was out for a run. I remember getting home, but then everything kind of blurs together. Next thing I know, I'm here. Seems about right. I'll see you later. But like, I I got into Metal Gear because they would always make so many Metal Gear jokes. And I'm like, you know what? I, I just want to get the jokes. I've never cared about Metal Gear. Then I watched a full no commentary Let's Play Metal Gear 1. And then I'm like, oh, I thought this was like a serious, boring thing. Like, God, this is silly. And then I played MGS2 on my PS2 and went, oh, this game is very silly. I'm back flipping down a hallway naked. This is a great game. And I beat it. And when I beat it, fighting all those Metal Gear Rexes is just Raiden on a fucking broken strut. And then duking it out with uh, Solidus. Oh, oh, I felt like, I felt amazing. And then I beat Metal Gear Solid 3 on the 3DS. And that was awesome. That was the boss oh man that was it was so hard oh but i felt like a fucking superhero when i won hang on i'm getting a phone call I will be right back. It seems there is some fresh chocolate chip cookies waiting for me downstairs.
I have returned. Sorry for the wait. Oh, I forgot to put up intermission. Apologies for that. But I made myself some hot chocolate to go with my hot chocolate chip cookies. I will now partake. Gotta say, my mouse pad makes a doubles as a great couple coaster. Hi, I'm Wooly. Hello, Wooly. I'm Emma. I'm sorry, but I can't really talk right now. I'm a doctor, and I have to help Zachary here. What does Zachary have to say? Sir, if you're going to go outside, I strongly advise against it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alright, how come? My name is Zachary. I think I might have been the first to wake up here. I was trying to get into that castle when I noticed something sort of imp running away with a key. I grabbed a flashlight and followed it out into the woods. I did get the key, but then I was attacked by something horrible. I lost both the flashlight and a key, and barely managed to get back here in one piece. You could get hurt. Thanks for the warning. If I go out there, I'll be careful. I'm Molly. Seems we're all in this bit of trouble. Seems we're all in a bit of trouble, right, Zach? Zachary, if you don't mind. You're no fun. Get well soon, man. If you're going out there, I'd advise sticking to the lit path. I could have sworn I saw something big move among the trees. Oh, who's that mysterious stranger? Hiding in the corner here. Hey, mate. Who are you? Hey, yeah, 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 Wooly, do you, do you have any clues? Uh, any clue what's going on? Uh-huh. Hmm. Wow, everything is just crumbling apart around us. Just like society. Totally. There's nothing for us to do but await the darkness inside to claim the rest of our own self. So what's your name? Dang, I almost had you. I know. No, just looping. Oh, door. And I'm allowed in. Who might you be? Hey, my name is Willie, and I'm trying to figure out what's going on. Good evening, Willie. I'm Sarah, and I suppose I'm doing the same thing. Badly. How come? I've looked everywhere I can think of inside the castle, but almost all the doors are locked. No keys, no clues, nothing. That man Zachary went outside the castle, but apparently almost got killed. He said he almost brought a key with him, but lost it. Then one of us might need to go get it. I'm just gonna wait a few hours or more. Maybe someone will come for us. Honestly, I doubt it. It takes a bit to cool down the hot chocolate before it's edible. Ah, uh, yeah. Save right there. Kitchen, HP 88, ammo 4. Our crew egg uh, pumps out some hot, hot liquid. Oh, I can only hold one health potion? Boo. No, that's, that's not enough damage to warrant drinking an entire potion. No, oh, that door is inaccessible. Can't even look at it. What about this door? Nothing doing. How about you? Evening. Name's Alexander Belanger. Alexander Belanger. Not Alex. It's Mr. Belanger or nothing. 
Hello, Mr. Belanger. My name is Willie. Have you noticed anything strange lately? Son, everything here is strange, especially that short angry man you came in with. Don't like the look of that one. Well, yes, but I mean if you might have noticed anything that... Son, let me stop you right there. I don't know anything that could help. I just don't. Well, alright. Goodbye, I guess. Now then, Pat, give me... <laughs> provide to me your wisdom. From what I can tell, nobody else here knows any more than we do. They just woke up in this castle with no memory of how they got here. Nobody seems to know each other. I don't know why, but I have this deep hatred for all of them. Don't you kind of hate people in general? Willie, that couldn't be further from the truth. I just hate talking to people. Pat understands. He gets it. That's why when I first started listening to them, I'm like, Pat's crazy. But as the years went on and I got older, I'm like, Pat's crazy, but maybe I'm crazy too. Because the shit he's saying is starting to make sense. So, Pat, think you can help me out with some stuff? Well, wait, apparently there are monsters both in here and out in the forest. I'm not doing shit. Oh, no. Looping dialogue. Alright. What about this door? Nothing. Alright, I think that's everyone. I'm down one cookie and a full glass of hot chocolate that's too hot to drink. Wait, doesn't this heal me? The water and fountain is clean. The sound is quite nice, even soothing. No. No, it does not. Maneuvering X and the arrow key at the same time. It's hard. Got no hand to eat the cookie. Hmm. Is that? Oh. No, that was a street lamp. Man, I sure am glad I taught myself how to eat food under a certain weight with no hands. You just put it in your mouth and grip it. Chew while you grip with your lips. It makes doing things so much easier. When you don't have to put down your food. Because if it's something you're doing constantly, like playing a game, and you want to eat your cookie while it's still nice, hot, warm, filled with gooey chocolate, but you don't want to just pause the game to eat a cookie. That's silly. Just grip it with your lip and chew, swallow, then pull it in, repeat. What's this? Statue of a dancing fawn. Looks very old and you can see patches of moss on it. Cool. The branch in the path there, okay. Now, I don't think I'm going to beat this tonight. Maybe someday I'll revisit it and, like, do it in a single stream. Because it is doable in one stream. Pat did do it in one go. I think it took him, like, two and a half hours, I think. What have we here? Hey! <laughs> Ah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Here we go. You've picked up an old flashlight. Yeah, it's one of them old ass flashlights. It still works and the light is bright. Darkness won't overcome you. This has the very blunt waft of progress, I'd say. It's a. If anyone's wondering the yeah, 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 yeah that I do sometimes, 
I 100% uh, picked that up from Wooly. It wasn't until one day I was listening to the podcast and they d talked about something and I went, yeah. And then Wooly did it too. Then I'm like, wait, oh shit. I, now I'm doing it. I hadn't even noticed up to that point. Rusty key looks just like the one you found in the dungeon, so it likely goes to the castle. Well, I guess I found what I was looking for. Shit. What the hell? Who turned off the lights? This might be a good time to head back. If. Now, if I remember right, the reason it's dangerous is because of some giant spoders that hang out in these here woods. Being all creepy and multi-legged. But yeah, you, you can see how this is very horror game adjacent. Doesn't quite have the tension stakes that uh... Um, a lot of other games do. Don't like the missing statue, that's no good. But, uh, yeah, 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 it's defi yeah, yeah, definitely yeah, yeah, creepy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Swear I, I f could feel like I'm being yeah, yeah, watched. Yeah, yeah. Oh no. <laughs> Fucking run. Don't like that. Don't like that. It's getting closer. As it's getting closer, it's making light. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I forgot how creepy this man is. <sighs> Didn't like that. Don't like him. He's a, that man is a no-go for me. Okay, I think I'm safe now. That was not a great time. I hope this keys was worth it. Let's check in. How's our uh how's our Pat doing? Hey Pat. You look a little worried. Did something happen out in the forest? Yeah, I was chased by something really disturbing. How disturbing are we talking about here? It was kinda like being chased by your mother. I can't believe I have to ask this. Your own mother or mine? Actually, don't answer. Are you okay? Barely. So, that's... That's a reference to way, way back in the day. When, like... Like, there was the running joke of Pat's mom. It, it was just vague. It wasn't even anything. It was just, like, just, uh, we, we need something, like, something to go here. What is it? Uh, Pat's mom. It was just a joke placeholder. It was, it was funny for the fact that it was absurd. But uh, I, I think it had a spiritual successor in uh, Wooly's mom and her uh, very religious ways when he was growing up and to this day. What were, were they Seventh Day Adventists, I think? Right, key. Oh no. Ow, you dick. Give me this. Ow. Yeah. Ah, the game doesn't pause, it's right. When you're in the text prompt, it doesn't pause. Oh. 
camera. That's a reference to the good old um, oh, what's the game called? Uh, Fatal Frame. We're still waiting on another good one. It's a journal, although written as a transcript. Smith King, this is absolutely unacceptable. You had no right. King, I had every right. It wasn't real. Cook, how can you even say that? Did you see the look in her eyes? King, I didn't, I don't need to. It wasn't real. Smith, if I had known, I would never have made you that g. It just abruptly stops there. Was it going to say G-Man? It's actually typing of the dead. Some creatures don't like light. Oh god. Oh, I'm going back. I remember this room. I need to save. Run. <clears throat> health tonic okay how did you get all the way over there so I remember this upcoming room it is uh, not a fun one Never, never mind, I made it through. Sweet. Oh, is it? No, it was this one. Wait. No, I'm just gonna. Gonna go save. Excuse me. Always rotate your saves. Always. Is it not enough? I can't believe you've used them all. You savage, here you go. What? Oh. It's providing me more saves. I got him. All right, read the book. This journal took many long years. But the castle was finally complete, and we're all settling in nicely. Sure, it was difficult, but what are a few years to us anymore? Even. It's kind of amazing how far we've come, and now I finally have time to really test what it would, what this place can do. I'm moving into the tower tomorrow, and I can't wait to get started. So it's a fucking wizard tower? Sounds like stuff a wizard would say. Yeah, take that. Oh, I'm rocking it. Oh, okay. That takes me back outside. Now you see. You see.
That's why you rotate your saves. Because I had lost a lot of ammo that I didn't need to lose. Because there was absolutely no point in killing him if he's just going to respawn the minute you re-enter. Simple as that. Yeah, and you see, now that one was worth it. What's a toilet? You have seen a toilet before, no? You notice that there seems to be something down the pipe, but out of your reach. It's another rusty key, and it is also very disgusting. This key should open another door somewhere in the castle. I applaud your instinct to check the plumbing, but I'm baffled by the fact that that's where you line went. See, I, I probably have like 80 health. See? Perfectly fine. Then you run back in. And then you save. Look at that. See? 72. That's nothing. That's I'm fine. I'm in the good zone. So that key goes, let's check out over here. Oh no, that just, that opened. Oh, I see. Okay. I've essentially unlocked all the first floor. Pat, where did everyone go? Everyone else went inside. Not me though. I'm not moving from this spot. If you see anything weird out of here, let me know. Okay. I mean, uh, the banjo kazooie grunts are the f they're th the fucking greatest. It's absolutely brilliant. I don't know what made Remurai think of it, but brilliant move, absolutely genius. Uh, an old key. No. Yes. I hit enter and exited the menu. And now my hot chocolate's the perfect temperature. Hot, but not scalding. It's a red pouch containing some bullets. I bet this is the king's room. I am not the king, so it seems I'm not allowed in. Up this- Ah! Now you see, this is here. Because every horror game that has paintings, you gotta have Kronos eating his kids. Because one, it's a very famous painting, and two, it's terrifying to look at. The man, that is a demon beast eating a child. And the best friends hate it. Pat, Wooly, Liam, Matt, they all hate it. I personally, I love it. I think it's great. But every time they see it, it's just, oh god, no, not this again. So it's, it's great fun. And so every horror game any of them ever play, it's, we gotta look, is Kronos eating his kids somewhere? And a lot of times, like, no, no, oh, 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 there it is, it's off in the corner, they hid it from us. It's a journal, it says, I've been experimenting with magic, and I've found some favorable results. I was right, it's a wizard tower. We've always known that objective reality isn't always to be expected here. Now, I'm almost at the point where... Imbuing qualities of specific nature into objects is possible. Most importantly, I think I figured out how to keep the traits even when not observed. There's a note, last page. Whoever keeps putting the keys to the second floor in the toilet, I just want you to know the king hates it. Keep doing it. Cool. going up
Yeah, tiny ones take tiny hits. A beautiful silver feather radiating with a strange power. Those who carry this on their person will have their burdens lift just a little. You will no longer take damage from falling, or rather from hitting the ground too hard. Yeah, yeah. Druid map of the island. A building in the southwest is circled in red. To view, select a new... Okay. That's the old, the old joke. It's like, no one's ever died from falling. It's when they stop that kills them. And it's true, you don't die from the... falling down. It's when the ground abruptly stops your momentum. Though if you hit terminal velocity, you might snap your neck, so that could kill you. So it is possible, it's just very unlikely. The king originally built the lighthouse in order to reach out. He wanted to see if there was anyone out there in this vast, cold, empty sea. That's changed. Recently, he's been obsessed with keeping a monster inside her lair. He wants it to be lit at all times, and he wants my magic to point it straight at the entrance. I'm not sure if this is facing your mistakes or running from them. Either way, I don't like it. Journal. Uh oh. Argument. Leaf. Ow. Oh no, I think I just died. Oh no. Oh boo. I can't believe this has happened. Oh fuck. I can't believe you've done this. Oh, Jesus. Where does that take me? Oh, that's barely above, like, 50. Oh, man. Damn. I guess it's because I thought they'd kill the giant spider that I didn't have trouble in the bathroom. I remember Pat and Paige were having a fucking time with it. Someone left a journal up here. You read the last passage. The past few days have been very difficult. I sometimes come up here to clear my head. Spending time breathing in the fresh ocean air, feeling the cool breeze, and looking at the stars usually fill me with calm. Not anymore. Now I just hear this incessant roaring hiss in my ears. It's not nearly as troubling as the shrieks we can all hear coming from the woods. Yeah, I would definitely say that's much more troubling. Well, let me in. There... <laughs> There's Pat just hanging out in his corner. Chest is filled with sheet music, music instruments. Out of all of them, the only thing you could consider taking is the hauntingly beautiful violin. However, you figure it would probably make for a great blunt weapon exactly once. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If Pat were as in here, he would make me play Moonlight Sonata to unlock something. Might as well give it a shot. I mean, I know the melody, and have good hand-eye coordination. How hard can it be? <laughs> it turns out it's very hard. I have a newfound respect and hatred for the classical musical arts. Oh. The, the little punch at the end is what really fucking, just like, that. that's what sells it. That's that's the thing that sells it. It's like, yeah, now I believe it. I don't know. Back in here. Head up. No, I wanted to try the king door again. Back in. Me at the door. Nah, I don't have whatever's required. The crown, I guess. Maybe, probably. So I have Monster Hunter up on my screen TV because I was playing it before I started streaming. I've unlocked a whole bunch of the layered armors, so I figured might as well. I wanted to make like some D&D &D classes with them. I've got a pretty good Barbarian, a decent Necromancer, and I think an okay uh, Ranger. But uh, I'm looking at the version number, and it's 15.02. 
and it's not going to change anytime soon, and I'm upset that it didn't end on a full version number. It's got to be a .02. It can't end on version 15. Just straight 15 no numbers. Damn. Yep, yep. Everyone else went inside. Inside where, the Pat? Inside where? Well, time to save. Right there. Oh, I resaved over save one, it seems. No, I'm good. Apparently the saving mechanic has a hair trigger. But what do you mean everyone else went inside? Would they go inside the dungeon? Doesn't seem like it. Nah, seems... Seems pretty empty. Huh. Now I know I didn't check the whole way in, but like... They can't jump. How would they get over there? But, um, guess I gotta go out into the woods. Probably gonna call it soon, so I think this adventure into the woods will be the last one I take for tonight. Whether I make it back to town to save, or to die out here before the stream ends, is, um, the fuck was that? I could have sworn I just saw something, like, fall off the edge there. Has this always been here? Large pillar has been placed here. Why you couldn't fathom? Huh. Weird. What is that split in the path? No, that's a car. It's like two blocks over revving. I thought I heard something in the game. I said two blocks over because it was very, very distant. Because I didn't so much hear it as I felt the rev in my headphones. They just started vibrating. Yeah, see? No, way! Don't... <laughs> I forgot! Didn't know what you were messing with. It's uh, something his mom would say a lot. You don't know what you're messing with. And uh, when, once once everyone found out, that became like the running joke of... Like, a spooky shit. Oh, you don't know what you're messing with. But now that it's booted me to the menu for dying, I think this is a good place to call it. So, uh, as, uh, for this video, go check out, uh, Castle Super Beast is the podcast. If you want the full history, I recommend watching the channel Super Best Friends Play from first video to last video. And listening to the... SBFC Super Best Friend Cast on iTunes or Spotify or wherever. And then that ends and immediately starts up into Castle Super Beast. So you go from uh, Matt, Pat, Wooly, and Liam to Matt, Pat, Wooly. And now uh, with Castle Super Beast, just Pat and Wooly. 
Uh, for their individual channels, uh, please go to... I want to make sure I get Liam's right. I always misremember it. Here we go. Rising Superstream. A play on the fact that Liam was the rising superstar of the channel. Pat stares at Wooly Versus and Matt McMuscles on YouTube. And I believe that's all the exact same for Twitch. Uh, and I'm pretty sure it's exactly the same for Twitter. Also, check out Remurai's YouTube channel and his Twitter. Watch his, uh, watch his uh, animations. He just put up uh, a new one today of him and his friends playing... What game is it? Is that one everyone... Phasmophobia everyone's playing. Ooh, maybe me, Cody, and Meredith should play it. He posted that today, seven hours ago, so do check that one out. It's it's not uh, best friends related, no Pat, no Wooly, no anyone. It's just him and his friends, and it's it's, it's quite funny. I enjoyed it. Uh, but that's about it for the, um, the, uh, uh is it shilling? It's not shilling, it's... Telling you about content that's probably better than mine. Ever will be. I hope to someday be half as good as them. I can dream. But, yeah. So, uh, try out the game for yourself. Maybe you'll get farther. Maybe I'll come back to this. Who can say? But, uh, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please hit that uh, follow button if you're on Twitch, and subscribe and hit the bell if you're on YouTube. If you enjoyed the video, if you didn't, it doesn't matter to me. Please hit the button. Please. 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 You don't have to come back. It, it, it'd just be a nice gesture. I mean, if, you, if, if anyone watched this, if you watched this far, com comment in the comments. Let me know. I'd be surprised if anyone made it this far. But, uh, I will be streaming tomorrow morning. Probably some Dark Souls. Uh. Yeah, Dark. Should I farm souls to buy magic for the stream? Nah, I'll just buy it with what I get in the stream. But, uh, yeah. So, that's about everything. So, once again, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Please tune in next time, and as always, enjoy the rest of your whenever, and goodbye. <laughs>